Being from North Texas, I've pretty much always known about Criswell College, but never really thought about attending here until after I'd received my undergraduate degree and I was in the middle of a master's degree at another school and just got discouraged by uh, the theology and the general approach to ministry that they had. And so I just quit school. But my music minister was attending classes at Criswell and invited me to come over here and just sit in on one of his classes. I sat in on one class and was here until I finished my Master's of Divinity. Well, the core of the courses that are required for all the students are biblical studies materials. And so the students learn the languages, Greek and Hebrew. They learn how to work in Scripture and be honest with what the text says. And then they become effective communicators of that. They learn how to share with others the things that they've gained in it. Uh, the other courses that we offer that are required for most students, and some of them are required for all students, like my courses, the humanities courses, are designed to shape their entire worldview around Scripture and around how to be good communicators of that Scripture. And so we don't want them to leave and simply be good Sunday school teachers or good preachers or pastors. We want them to leave and be good disciples of Jesus in every part of their lives. And I believe our curriculum accomplishes that. Uh, this is the, my favorite part of Criswell College is the faculty. We get to spend time together, so obviously I love them and I'm friends with them. Uh, but their focus on their individual callings, on their ministries, on their academic disciplines uh, is remarkable to me. I learn from all of them and I enjoy the sincerity of their Christianity in every single one of them. The Student Life Office obviously does a lot of things to keep the students attached to each other and uh, encourage them in those kinds of relationships that they can have with each other. And they have events here that the students participate in. Most of the students I know are really involved in their churches, involved in ministries, and they're involved with other Criswell students who are involved in those churches and in those ministries as well. And so it's just part of living out their Christianity that they end up being dependent on each other and encouraging each other in their obedience to the Lord. Yeah, one of the great privileges I've had at the school is that most of my classes are very small. Uh, at other schools where I've taught, I may have 60 students in, in a class normally. Uh, here I can have anywhere from 10 to 25 students, but most often 10 to 12 or something like that. And in the humanities program especially, that's allowed me to, to develop really good relationships with students who've gone on to uh, further their education at other institutions for a doctorate or whatever, but also in the preaching classes that I've taught. I've had small classes, which means I've gotten to know preachers very well and been able to see them and even help them find places to preach and even to become pastors now just because we were able to have a personal relationship. So it's been, uh, it's been a real privilege to get to know them well. One of the first things potential students always raise with me when they consider coming to school is just the cost. Uh, how could I afford to go to a private school? They would imagine it's like going to all the other private schools they're at. But I'm able to encourage them greatly in several ways, number one of which is we have a lot of donors who are willing to support students through the school in the form of scholarships and grants and so and such uh, because they recognize what we do as a school. They, it's not hard for us to approach someone who understands what uh, the Bible is about, understands what Christianity is about, tell them what our school is about, and know that they will want to give because we actually do accomplish with students what those people who have resources and are just looking for somewhere they can invest the resources and actually uh, see a life changed or encourage in obedience to ministry, uh, they're willing to give to Criswell College. So uh, it's a big deal to us that we keep tuition costs extremely low so that students who can't afford a car good enough to drive here can still afford to come here. That's a big deal to us. You know, it's a, one of the greatest things about Chriswell is that I've been totally free here because of my basic doctrine that I believe in Scripture, I believe in uh, the authority of pastors, I believe in the message of Scripture, uh, because I believe in salvation through Christ alone, in, by faith alone, by grace alone. I believe in all of that. I'm totally free to teach here in the humanities program. We read intense materials from people who are non-believers so that we can be fully equipped 
to confront things that are out in the world. So the exciting thing to me about Criswell College is that people really are learning what it takes to live out Christianity in the real world right here and now. And I see that with excellent students. And I see it with students who come in and I really wonder you know, what they're going to do. But when they leave, I know what they're going to do. And uh, that makes it all worthwhile to me.